Hi, welcome to Hartman Business Machines YouTube channel. Today's episode will be going over um, the paper trace settings and the paper type settings of the Ricoh 03 series. This one in particular is the Ricoh MPC 3503. What you are probably familiar with is if you don't send the right paper type through the print driver to the machine without the right paper tray settings, you're gonna get a paper mismatch. So what I'm gonna show you now is how to change the paper trays to be at the mercy of the print driver commands rather than what the machine thinks it has in the trays. So, for example, if you go to copier and you'll see no paper types are set in here, but if one said thick three, then you would have to send a paper type of thick three from the print driver for it to be able to print to this, um, to this paper tray. So, what I'm gonna do is point you uh, in the direction of is the user tools counter button. Then you wanna go into the printer features. Then under system, you wanna to go to the next page and you'll see the tray setting priority. Okay. This is for anybody really that has a number of paper mismatch errors coming up on the screen when they type. Um, this is a band-aid fix for those people because what you want to do is properly set your paper trays to the paper types that are in there. But if there's a lot of multiple users using tray two, three or four or even one as um, special paper or thick paper or just plain paper, then this is a good setting for you guys to use. Just know that if you did send the wrong document to the tray with the wrong paper type, it's still going to print. Okay, so if that even uh, made sense to anybody, probably watching this it would have. But what I want you to do is in all of bypass tray, tray one, two, three, and four, is I want you to change that to driver command. Press OK. Tray one, driver command, OK. So on and so forth. So now, if you stuck a piece of paper in, let's just say you wanted labels printed out of tray two. So now, obviously the fuser needs to heat up that little bit more to stick or to properly fuse the, the print to that slipperier, thicker paper stock. Um, what you would need to do normally is set the paper type to labels or thick one and then in turn set the bypass tray or any of the trays to that same paper type. Now, you won't need to. Hope this helps.